A Turville's fire in Summit County has burned 350 acres so far today and is 0% contained. Now, fire investigators believe that this blaze is arson. News for Utah's Nick McGurk joins us live near that fire with details. Nick? Well, Glenn, that announcement coming from officials late tonight that arson is believed to be the cause of this fire. You can see it sort of snake up the mountainside behind me, that orange line, smoke surrounding it. And Summit County investigators say they definitely need your help trying to figure out who started this fire. Everybody's coming up to grab what they can and, you know, just praying. For hours, homeowners up Echo Creek Ranch have watched smoke fill the sky. There's nothing we can do. But I didn't want to be at home. Steve Carroll couldn't stay home. He knew he had to be close to his cabin. One of some 100 structures, he says, are under a pre evacuation zone. Officials say it was right here along I 80 that this fire started just about 2 o'clock this afternoon. Now you can see all the charred landscape here. The fire began and spread up the mountainside, that plume of smoke continuing to grow. We're going to be monitoring the fire all through the night. We've got a lot of air resources here, two helicopters, two heavy air tankers, four single engine air tankers, and air attack. With water drops by air and crews on the ground, this fire had a lane of I-80 eastbound closed for hours. Even as miles away, those with the most to lose stand and watch. They put their heart and soul into the cabins up here. So we're just praying and we don't want to lose what we've spent all our life building. Now, according to officials, Summit County had really, really fast response to this fire. Really helped uh, uh, the fact that this could have spread over I-80 into where traffic was basically heading back into Salt Lake after a long holiday weekend. So there were things about this fire that could have been worse. Uh, we're told certainly fast action helped contain it uh, east. Uh, sort of on the right side of, of eastbound I-80, but certainly a lot to talk about with this fire. We have arson as a suspected cause. Investigators say they need your help, and obviously the fire continues to burn. So we're going to be monitoring the progress overnight, and we'll get you know tomorrow uh, if this has grown as they fly it tonight, and certainly uh, try to make sure it does not spread. We are live in Summit County tonight. I'm Nick McGurk, News 4 Utah.